The final two contenders for the Australian Open Women's Singles Championship have been unveiled after two intense semi-finals showdowns on the 11th night of the tournament. The stage was set for a battle between two Grand Slam champions, former AO winner Victoria Azarenka and Wimbledon champ Yelena Rybakina. And this girl is as relaxed as it comes. The 23-year-old from Kazakhstan, known for having one of the best serves in the comp, brought her weapon out early, three aces in the opening game. The two women were a tight matchup. The first break went to 33-year-old Azarenka. Oh, gets the break. What a point from Azarenka. But the next came straight after and they were back on serve. Oh, that's just beautiful serving. That set the tone for the rest of the match. Several more breaks. Too good. Incredible hitting from both girls, actually. This forehand on Duran from Vika was fantastic, but just not good enough against Rybakina. And several missed opportunities. Rybakina nearly closed the first set 6-3, as Renka wasn't ready to let go. Oh. She broke back and pushed it to a tiebreaker, but couldn't quite close it out. Pushes it wide, and Rybakina takes the first set. 22nd seed Rybakina made the early impact in the second. Yeah. Impressive couple of games. The rising star who's only dropped one set all tournament was a force to be reckoned with. Read that drop shot so early. It felt like anything was possible until the very last shot. It wasn't to be for Azarenka. She'll be flying home to see her seven-year-old son. And that'll do it. Our 22nd seed, Elena Rabaikina, is through to the Australian Open final. 7-6, 6-3. Yelena Rybakina became the first woman to make it through to the 2023 Australian Open final, 7-6, 6-3. It's really amazing to play in front of you guys, so thank you so much. And uh, yeah, we see how it's going to go, but uh, for sure I try my best, I, I fight and uh, yeah, hopefully I'm going to win. <laughs> Up next on Centre Court, two women anxious to secure the remaining position. Fifth seed Arena Sabalenka and unseeded Magda Lynette from Poland. Two of the tournament's hardest hitters. Did you get that, Laura? The opening two games went to the AO's surprise package, Magda Lynette, but Sabalenka, who hasn't lost a set all tournament, quickly caught up. The pressure was on as world number 45 served to stay in the set. Coast to coast and perfection applied for Lynette as well off the backhand side. And after 45 minutes, we're in an opening set breaker. The tiebreaker was one-sided, Sabalenka overpowering her opponent. For a fourth time, she is just one set away from a place in a major final. The tense matchup continued in the second, both women pushing each other to the limit. Twenty-four-year-old Sabalenka grabbed the first window of opportunity three games in. Lynette could see the Grand Slam slipping away from her. Sabalenka could taste victory, almost closing the set 6-1. Valiant defence from Lynette, but superior firepower from Sabalenka. But three match points slipped out of her grasp.
Yes, she can. A rousing reception from the crowd, from her box, and she keeps her slender hopes alive here in Melbourne, does Magda Lynette. Those hopes didn't stay alive much longer. The next game sealed her fate. Arena Sabalenka has done it. She's through to her maiden Grand Slam final in straight sets. And I'm not sure if you know, but your average speed on your forehand is up there with some of the men. I'm just wondering, does... <laughs> yes. <laughs> on Saturday, she'll get a chance to go even harder in the big one. Taking on Yelena Rybakina for the Australian Open Championship.